Hello everyone, this is uh, Jinko and today uh, we'll show you how to expand the channels on Fruits GDM to make uh, possible adding multi-fruit to, to a map. So first of all you must unzip your desired map. Inside maps in the data folder you'll have these GDMs. You will need to copy the fruits GDM. Now I will navigate to my Vimeo Windows service because on macOS this won't work. I'll try to paste it now. Good. It worked. Uh, next, I have the GRELE converter from Giants Develop uh, Development Software Networks GDN something. I will put the link in the description. And uh, you must let me open again. You must drag the density map for the GDM to the convert command and it will save it as PNG. But where did it save it? Let's try again because I had it already. Convert it. Let's delete. So, convert. Yes, and now it shows here. Uh, I wanted to make sure it's the right file. So, the next step is to install Python minus an ARM version because it's a our version of Windows running from VMware, via, via VMware, so how to pronounce it, I don't know. Uh, run as administrator. Yes. You have to select this two before installing because Otherwise, Python won't work from uh, PowerShell. Installing now. Close. Okay, now going back to software. You have to download the Python script. The link will be in the description. And you also have to install Pillow. Let's see. Open the terminal, the PowerShell. I don't remember the line. Oh, I have already installed, but if you uh, give this code, it will download and install a pillow extension for Python. That will need to run this uh, script. Now, you need to copy the path for the density map fruits PNG file and edit with idle or notepad, doesn't matter, the path here. So, 
you must delete the name the last slash also this symbol and I saw in the tutorial that that model also changed the slashes I don't think it's necessary but let's see save and close now we sh we must open again the terminal partial type python 32 to 64 underscore run dot py and should run the script now let's see if that works okay so we need the slash let's correct that open again okay file save and close let's try again works that's waiting on that. finished let's see oh this is the file now I need this file to get back to Mac OS We'll rename it as intended. Just fruits. Now let's see where it was. Here, Zilonka Maps Map Evil Data. We'll delete the GDM. We we'll delete the height because we are adding the blank one. The map is 2x, so uh, let's not move it, just copy it. Rename and remove the 2x thing. Now to make the game to load the PNG, we also need to expand those layers. So let's copy the map in the mouse folder where it is. Here. Maps, map, now open the i3D with notepad. Search for foliage multilayer or foliage M, doesn't matter. See where the crops are. This must be now 12, 6, 6. And let's get this bigger. And uh, the terrain detail height needs to be 14, 7, 7 here, 7 here. If you are here, let's change the displacement. Zero four. Save. Now search for fruits GDM here and change to PNG because we have a PNG file instead of GDM. Save, quit, and now the map should 
open. Let's see. The easiest way to convert back the PNG to GDM would be opening uh, the i3D with uh, Giant's Editor. But because I can't run Giant's Editor on Mac or a virtual machine, I will make a save game. I will show you how. So let's see. This is Zelonka. It's not done yet. Okay, we don't want the farm. Continue. Select all. We don't actually care today. We want only to see if the map works. Mm, I should have added a mod, but let's see. First of all, we'll go back. So it works. I can see everything is in place. All the foliage. Also the props should be in place. Yes, it's all okay. Now let's go back because I missed a mod. I need it to save. A GDM file. Yes. Try again. No. No. Continue. You select all. You will need, if you want, don't want to use JNC editor, you will need easy dev development control. start now we need this node because we need to remove all the that all the foliages from the fields so here on field farm round let's select all fields I think is this seeds set field ground all you will need to set it to cultivate it uh, remove foliage and confirm Now all the map is like this, no foliage in the fields. Save the game. Quit the game. Now in the save game files, it was four I believe. We will need to copy this. Get back to the mods. So for Zelonka. Maps. Data. Copy this. Now we can remove this. We'll keep it in case we missed somehow. Open again with notepad, mine is text edit. Search again from fruits GTM. Now it won't show nothing because it's fruits PNG. Get back to GDM. Save. Quit. Let's try to run the map again. It should work fine.
for some reason the new doesn't want to start at all. Hello. And save, continue, you select all, why not, start, confirm, and as you see, the crops are here, the GDM is working fine, all the textures are here, and the map is ready to add the motor fruit. Hope you enjoy. We'll work on the tutorial for adding the pack. Might mention this again, but for now this is the easiest way to prepare the map for more to fruit. I think there is a script for the heights GDM as well if you want to prepare a map that is a mining map of sorts or has some bulk types on the ground, heaps of lime or whatever. But uh, if I find a li uh, link for that, I will uh, put it in the description as well. Have a nice day. Thank you for watching.